What's going on YouTube Snipes here with TKO Gaming bringing you guys a video on how to get to max light in Destiny 2. Now in the last video I told you guys I can see myself getting to 285 light before the raid. Now I think that I may be able to get a little bit higher. Plus there's a trick on infusing that I'm going to share with you guys. But before we get into that guys if you want a really awesome giveaway in the next video and you guys want to see more content from me please do slap a like on this video it takes about 1.1 second if your mouse is moving really slow it'll really help out plus i'm gonna make sure to give an awesome video giveaway in the next one so let's get into this video oh and comment down below what your light level is right now so like the video comment down below what your light level is followed by hashtag destiny 2. now let's go ahead and get into why you need to listen to this in detail tell your friends about this too because I made some mistakes that I wish I didn't. So I got legendaries that dropped at 270, 275, and we'll talk about how and when they started dro dropping that high. And I infused that 270 legendary into a lower legendary because I wanted that lower legendary to move up because it was such a good crucible weapon, I'll make a video on it. And instead of it going all the way up to 270, it actually only went to 265. And I realized is because the weapon I infused into it had a weapon mod attack of plus five. So essentially I got screwed out of that and I wish I had known, but it's a mistake I made. So I'm telling you guys, this is literally the step-by-step -step process on how to get to 280 plus before the raid and then 300 light post raid or possibly before raid because there is a legendary engram that scales to your light and i'm at 267 light i'll probably find out today how far up it can go my speculation is it can go higher than the required light for the raid because that's usually how bungie does it since destiny one that's what they've been doing so let's go into what you want to do now i made a video on how to get to 200 plus light really fast you guys can go check that video out it's really easy there's a great farm spot in that video as well but essentially what you want to do is you want to do the campaign milestones european dead zone all that stuff before you start going to the vendors for legendaries all right this is a big mistake make sure that you get to about 240 250 light just go ahead and farm around that's literally all you need to do just farm around and get to that light once you realize that okay the loot i'm getting is lower than my light level then you need to go and start going to the vendors and getting higher legendary gear the way you do that is you get the tokens and the whatever you need from the chest the the little you know uh, materials on each planet for those vendors you go and collect all those and then you turn those in you rank up those vendors and they give you loot they give you legendary loot and that legendary loot will be higher it'll get you to 265 light so make sure that that's what you have to do Another mistake I made was legendary gear can come with a weapon mod attack or a defense mod attack of plus five. So do not infuse that into a lower legendary gear because I had a weapon, I was like 223, then I had a 270 legendary. I infused the 270 into the 223 thinking it'll go up to 270, but that weapon mod attack went away and I wasn't able to do that. So make sure you guys keep that in mind. That is also the trick to getting higher because all exotic weapon and armor come with a plus five so for example if you have an exotic at 245 and you have a legendary at 265 and you infuse that 265 legendary into the exotic that exotic will go to 270 not 265 because of the plus five mod on it now that is exactly how you can get as high as possible before the raid before trials just doing that now make sure that if you can avoid getting exotics please do so all right don't do any of the quests don't do the meet a multi-tool quest don't do any of those quests until you get at least 265 that way that exotic will scale much much higher i got my exotic at about 263 264 and it went to 278 so imagine exotics can drop all the way up to 280 or 280 plus depending on you know still need to test some things out and you guys can get to 285 light before the raid, which will most likely be 290 or 280 if it's the normal version. I think the heroic might be higher. So that's how you're going to get prepared. Tell your fire team and get prepared, guardians. If you guys want help in the raid or trials, make sure you check the description below. We're taking reservations in advance. We'll see you guys in the next video. Please do like and comment down below. I'll do a giveaway in the next one if you can get at least 1,000 likes. And make sure to subscribe if you haven't. There's going to be awesome videos coming out. Turn on the notifications so you don't miss a video. I love you guys so much. We'll see you in the next one. So many more videos coming out today and tomorrow. Peace out.